Hello and welcome back to another episode of Kataria Fables. Now, hopefully we have a few things that we can harvest and sell. Mainly cabbage. Yes. We're counting on- oh! Cabbage and corn. Okay, that works! But I think we were planning on keeping the corn. So, yeah, I think we wanted it for oil. Oh, wouldn't that just be thing if I meant to make oil to make those onion rings? Please, harvest the corn. I know you're opposed to the idea, but it's actually a maybe a slightly better idea than you think. No, all the corn. Yes, all the corn. Ah! Really? So we're going to need 20 crops. Question is, to water now or when we get back? Really is a good question at this point because I'm not really sure. And the idea that we're going to be spending more money again is just insane. We need to find a way to make money, not spend money. Spending money is the easy part, right? Alright, there we go. Maybe we can see about attacking some bees. They'll give us honey, too. Well, something we can turn into honey anyway. 600. Right, I'm sure that'll pay for the seeds that we're going to be buying today. Pretty soon we're also going to need to try upgrading our watering tools. Because this is... Well... Kind of taking a bit. I mean, watch that. I've already been at this for a minute. We should probably also remember to uh, fill the watering can up occasionally. I mean, we are running around with it. Oh no! In our inventory. Alright, Nyan's. Uh, or we can just take a small break from attacking creatures and doing all that stuff and go out and hit rocks. Bully the rocks. Mm, I like that idea. Not much in the way of reward, but right now it doesn't seem like much is. Ew. Yes, we'll just get eight of these. Hello. How are you doing? Okay, yeah, we can do eight of these too. Increases chant critical chance. Oh, cabbage is vegetable soup. Well, let's have a quick look at that. Fifty increases critical damage by ten points. Those seem like they would stack, doesn't it? Alright, we have a full slot bar there. We need to buy 20 of something. Got it? 20 of something. Not that. But let's see if we can go ahead and spend a lot of money today. Look, we spent a lot of money.
we're probably going to be selling these to try and get some money instead of using them for food. Because right now we do need to get 15,000 paw pennies, and so far every step forward we take, well, last two videos we're back basically at square one of just over 6,000 paw pennies. Now you can just go, well, you could just, you know, not buy things like that, but at the same time, we do need to try and get food. No! You had it! What happened? There we go. Looks like a little, uh, beautiful cat. I would like to attack the specters, but we're obviously not doing that right now since daytime. Small details, right? So I know we're gonna have to mess up some of what we're doing for a bit, because, like I said, I want to attack some specters. Oh! Yes, I was talking about attacking rocks, wasn't I? Yes. These rocks. We have this nice pickaxe. Let's use it, right? These once insanely strong rocks are now... Well, they're still really strong, but... It's not as... Bad. There we go. Actually, on that note... Let's go ahead and move this over. Occasionally I do like to try and keep this... Reasonably organized. Oh, let's leave the regular rock, though. Forest Sanctuary, here we go. Not really planning on hanging out and attacking anything, just running by and... ...going somewhere else. Hello, guys! Nice to see you again! How are you doing? How's everyone over here? Oh, just as cranky as always. Uh, thank you very much. We have forest defenders here. Yep, yep, there's a place to get stuck. Alright, now that we are through that not really big minefield... Let's go ahead. And negotiate with these rocks. I'm really glad we have this for these because seriously can you just imagine how bad it would be with the regular one? I think I've I already went there you know been there done that sort of deal but seriously a whole minute would be spent just attacking one rock and now it's a few hits five or six instead of uh, silver, the uncommon ore that is now much more common. Who would ever thought as you progress in the game, it's easier to find certain things that you need, right? I know you've never heard of that before, right? Alright, what is waiting us in here? We're looking for a little bit of adventure. And... Ah, uh, maybe not attacking with a dark gooey. I know we do actually need... Stuff. Let's... I want to attack this guy. I don't want to, uh... I mean... No. Shell bug. Ah, no. 
You're mean. You can make those venomous guys look nice. Oh no. Okay, we're out of there. Whew. I know he's probably going, I thought I saw something. I seriously thought I did. Um. Could be better. I don't. Okay. So here's a question. If the, those guys could get attacked by that, would they be mad at me or the other monster? I have a feeling they'd just be mad at me, though. They're like, nope, it's your fault, because if you weren't there, they wouldn't have thrown that to begin with. Oh! My money, thank you. Oh, no. No, I have to go all the way over there. I don't like that, though. Hey there. Thank you for the apple. Your contribution is greatly appreciated. Now I need to go collect my money, if you don't mind. Um, I'm more concerned of these guys. More along the lines of the venom than anything else. Are you locked on. Lock on to this guy. How do you get in there? Like, really? Didn't I come out to try and attack him? Thought I did. Nice timing. How'd you... Okay, attack him, please. Now we are going to try to attack the rocks. Which is mainly what we're here for, anyway. I don't know how long we'll have, so we need to try and make this quick. But look at all these pretty rocks with goodies from copper, silver, and gold. Really nice, huh? I should have hit more of those out there. So we're, we're gonna go ahead and hurry this up. And maybe do a little bit of exploring. And I mean a little. It's really just what's after this part. Nope, we do want to attack these. Thank you. Ah, the gold. The gold! Gold is cat's best friend once cat figures out how to use it. Minor details, right? Oh, my bad. I'm over here trying to move, going, why am I not moving? It's because your finger's on the caps lock button. And here we are. Yeah, I started doing the same things uh, that I'm currently doing to try and get Stardew Valley not so laggy. And playing this has actually gotten way, 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 way smoother. If only it worked like that for Stardew Valley, right? A little bit of money. Every little bit helps, right? Just going to sit there spewing poison? No. Thank goodness he decided to stop for a minute. Hmm. Oh, hi there, buddy.
Okay, well, that's not the worst ever. Ooh, this is a bit lengthy. I wonder where we're going. Get your fluffy butt back here. No apple? Really? Well, thanks, but that's my gold. Well, as long as you leave it for me, I guess I'll let you open it. There's still that, so something else is there. I wonder if it's just this guy. Nope, it's not. There's at least one more bat here. Thankfully, these bats aren't any stronger than regular bats. It's just the fluffy. The gooeys, however, are stronger than regular gooeys. Ew. Need to hurry this up. This probably is a bad idea, okay? I didn't know we'd have things spawning all the way down here. And look, there's another chest. Maybe if we get really lucky? There will be a save point. There's more things down there. Yeah, we don't want to get hit by it, to be honest. I appreciate your uh, diligence and- oh, hey! What does that require? A gold key? Yeah, it requires a gold key. Just get rid of this guy real quick. No? Uh, I understand why you want to attack that guy, but we need to attack this guy over here. This shield bug is doing more damage than just about anything else this thus far. Well, there's looks like there's somebody on the ground, so let's quickly get more of this and see what's going on. Oh, this this we've been doing this a lot longer than I thought we have just quickly get these, then get that other box over there. Get all the loot. Get all the loot. Yes. That's the idea. These are all mine. Yeah, we need to go talk to that person. Well, we can start that today, but I, I don't think we're gonna be able to finish it. Something about loot problems. Okay. I know there's a venomous guy over there, so let's make him feel welcome. Whoa! He's trying to make me feel welcome! No thanks! Okay. Whew. Hello? Hazel? We have to help! Yes, how do we do that? Basil, how do I help you? Uh, uh, okay, well, let's hope monsters don't spawn right behind us. That would be really bad. Injured person. Talk to Kelly at Riviera Fortress. Okay. It'll be a bit long today, but... 
Let's cross your fingers, hope that nothing really bad happens over here. <laughs> I'm just looking for a, a save slash wait point. We've arrived at the mountainside! You look red. What happened? There's so much snow. Is it always like this? How would I know? I thought that only mountain peak was covered in snow like this. It's not even winter. Has something happened to the weather? Brr, it's cold, like too cold. Let's find a shelter to warm up. Okay. And shelter. I don't want to get those boxes right now. They have, uh, a friend. They have a friend. The boxes have a friend. Is that friend's name in what color? Please tell me it's blue. Blue or, yeah, blue. Oh, good. It, it is in blue. All right, we're just, we're, we are going further. Where are we supposed to be going? Well, so far so good, right? All right, shelter is still a ways away. So I'm hoping that when we get, ah. Get over this bridge. Gandalf, get off of the bridge side. Okay, we're negotiating with Gandalf here. Alright. Oh, My goodness gracious. Okay, we are not in good condition. We have just been defeated. Uh, the mountainside is a bad place. Yeah, I'm sure you could figure that one out, but... Oh, okay, well that looks like a good place to end it for today. And I hope to see you next time. And uh, this time we'll try and keep on to the plan. Thank you very much, and I will see you later.